you touching? Did you guys sleep okay? So it is 8.43 in the morning and it is Sunday and I am going to head over to my aunt's house and we're gonna work on some stuff just really quickly. She wanted to learn how to make something and so I told her I would come and show her how to make it and then um, I had to come back home. I don't know what all I'm doing today. I know after four I'm gonna go do like an art project thing that I was working on at a friend's house and then I, I need to clean. I feel like that's like never ending and then I have a paper I have to work on but I'm only gonna give myself like an hour and a half to work on the paper today and see where I go from there. It's not due until like next Friday. Yeah, next Friday or Saturday. So I'm hoping to get it done and knocked out between today and tomorrow and then have someone look over it and then turn it in and be done and have like a good four days of no worrying before I start my mini semester. Like YouTube? Yeah, I mean you've already been at a bunch of them, so. And I lose <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't put you in because every time I put you in, I, get, I lose subscribers. Oh, then you shouldn't put me in. That's not good. <laughs> so Renee's making some chile. Uh, Renee. Uh, Renee. Uh, Renee. Renee's making the meat. Yeah, we need to try Renee now. Maybe he'll get us. Renee is making meat outside on the grill. And Frank is making chile. Making the hot sauce. And it because like it smells so bad already. Like <laughs> everybody's choking in here. <laughs> He's making green chile. And best salsa verde. Best salsa mm. verde. And then I'm just studying. So <laughs> I'm just chilling today. So Frank just made some chile and he's like, try it. And I'm so scared because I'm coughing and dying and I haven't even <coughs> tasted it yet. But I, here we go. It's good, it's salty. It's salty? It's a little salty. I don't know if it's a chip. Oh, it pickles my nose. It's good, Frank. You just gotta put like one more tamatillo in there. Cause it got a little salty. Tamatillo? What? Tamatillo? What? Tamatillo? The green tomato. Oh, one other one? Okay. That's why I didn't want to throw too much in there. It's just salty, but it's good. Let's send you another line. <laughs> <laughs> I hit because it. Like it's that hot. No, it doesn't. It's in my nose. Is it good? So ladies, are you single, Frank? Oh, very single. Okay, so Frank is single, so if you're in the Houston area, <laughs> peep him. I'm you available. can find him on Snapchat. What's your Snapchat, Frank? I'm single, bilingual, and ready to mingle. <laughs> the only thing is you have to be approved by me and Renee because he's over here all the time. So we have to like you. So hit him up on that. What, what's your Snapchat? My Snapchat is... Uh, Find me under Frank underscore Fuentes 24. Frank, I'll, I'll link it down below. Send him some snaps. <laughs> DM me. DM him. <laughs> Snapchat that. Ain't nothing that can come in between me and my brothers. Emily ain't nothing strong as that. And now he goes for her as strong as that. I'm flipping in the drink, got me saying a lot.
winter weather can put a damper on your holiday travel plans. Get four new car tires for as low as $16 a week at your local rent tires tables, plus tons of other... That just scared the crap out of me. <laughs> she said they love me unconditional. Imagine how I feel to watch another nigga act. You know that if you wasn't you, you would be dancing, you dog. with my workout it was a workout that Renee and his friends had posted yesterday and did but I changed it up a little bit and their workout they did 25 front squats 25 deadlifts 25 box or sorry back squats 25 box jumps 25 slam balls 25 wall balls 500 meter row and a 30 cal calorie air bike air assault bike sorry and so I changed it up I did the front squats I did the back, the deadlifts, I did the back squats. I didn't do the box jumps. Um, I just, I don't really like doing box jumps. And because I have like an old, old, old neck injury, whenever I do box jumps, the impact of jumping on the box, it just really ends up hurting my neck and gives me really bad headaches. So I'll usually do like box step ups, but today I did something new and it's where I used the flat bench press and I did those jump over things from side to side and I've never done that before. Um, so that was pretty cool. Um, trying to get coordinated for that, but I really liked it. And then, um, what else? We did box jump, oh, so then um, we, I did slam balls and then the next one, instead of wall balls, I did where you saw the barbell on my hips and I was laying like half of my back was on the, on the flat bench press or whatever. And I just kind of did like, I guess like, I don't know, I just know it works out your glutes and like your thighs and stuff. So I did that instead and then I didn't get it on video because I feel like it was boring. But um, I did a 500 cal calorie, sorry, 500 meter row. And I actually did that for a warm up too. So before I even started the workout, I did 500 meter row. Um, but I didn't record that part and I did a 30 calorie air assault bike. So that's what I did for the workout today and felt really good to get my workout done in the morning and just get it done and knocked out. It's um, 8.30 now. Um, I actually was meaning to get this done a lot sooner, but the kids are already inside. They already ate breakfast. They already um, got dressed and stuff like that. Mia is playing on the trampoline for a little bit and Josh is doing his independent reading. And so we're about to get our day started. But yeah, um, sorry yesterday's vlog was kind of like, I'm putting it together just because it just, I. I did a terrible job of recording. Um, I ran a couple errands and then I pretty much just, I gave myself an hour to work on a paper and three hours later I was like, ugh, I'm just drained. So um, Frank was here um, and he, him and Renee made, I, Renee's been craving like chili fries. And so um, they made some sort of Denver, um, because Frank used to live in Colorado for a while, but these, um, I don't know, like carnitas and fries with salsa. It's basically like nachos, but on fries. So that's what they had yesterday, and I had some too, so I really needed to get a workout in today. Um, I'm trying to get back into routine. I don't know if I've talked about it before, but this year has been just kind of like a steady, like I haven't progressed. I haven't lost any weight. I've gone up and down the scale um, like five to 10 pounds. And then I lose five pounds and then it kind of goes back up. But um, my weight's been fluctuating a whole lot this year. And I know it has a lot to do with like my eating habits and my choices and stuff like that. But um, I'm trying to get back in it. And I want to start getting back into the group before the new year because the holidays are coming up. And yes, that could be an excuse for saying like, oh, I'm not going to worry about it because the holidays and stuff. You know, you could, you could get crazy on Christmas Eve or Christmas Day, but like you don't have to ruin and just be like, well, since that day is coming up and since New Year's is coming up, I'm just gonna let the other days like and 
go bananas and ham and eat whatever I want. No, like, because then I'm going to feel awful. So let me just ease back into um, making healthier choices. Because in order to lose weight and in order to keep the weight off, you have to make it a life change. You can't just be like, oh, um, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And then, like, once you lose the weight, go back to the way you were living before. It's like, and I, I feel like, I mean, everybody knows this and stuff like that, but sometimes you gotta be reminded. And so, um, I definitely, I mean, I've come a long way, um, but I, I, there's a lot further I can go. But at the same time, when you go for so long, sometimes you need that rest. But I've been resting for way too long. So, and there's other factors into it, and I can get back, get into that later. But, um, definitely Renee and I are like we just need to make healthier choices and um, maybe we'll get into a video or sometime about how we're gonna do that again it's gonna be something that we can stick with it's gonna be something that's worked for us in the past and it's it's not a diet it's a lifestyle change so anyways um, I had a bunch of things like emails and stuff I was taking care of this morning so um, I have a paper to work on, but first I'm going to help the kids with their homeschool stuff and then see what's up from there. We'll see what the day brings. 